it's Lee. Welcome to Pink Flamingo Friday. Today I'm working on a couple of cards that are going to be similar. It is a little camper, the Glamper Camper from Avery L. And I have a friend who has a camper that looks just like this. Her name is Jan and I've been wanting to make her a card using this little set for the longest time and I just am finally getting around to it. I just stamped my images. I will be coloring them with Copic markers. So I stamped them with Memento ink. Oh, let me cover my ink. I am going to be die cutting them. I decided to use Nina Desert Storm card base. Kind of earthy for my cards. I stamped the images on Bristol cardstock. Let me start coloring. I love to color. One thing I don't understand, to me, pink flamingo should be an R, but it's an E. So what you gonna do? So I'm gonna start. I'm gonna use pink flamingo on the pink flamingos, and you tell me if it looks like a pink flamingo or not. What do you think? Does this look like a pink flamingo to you? I'm not seeing pink flamingo over much. I'm seeing that more as the background color of the Glamper Camp. Camper is a beige kind of color. Do you like camping? I used to love to go camping. Then I joined the army. I don't like to rough it anymore. I'm a little tired. Because you can kind of see better what I'm doing. I feel like doing it the cactus. My mind's everywhere today. Here, there, and everywhere. So I'm going to be bebopping from one thing to another. Light, medium, and then dark. Okay, so these colors are, the darkest one is YG17 Grass Green. The medium one is YG13 Chartreuse. And the lightest one is YG11 Mignonette. Mignonette. Good thing I speak French, huh? I start blending this back out so I can have some dimension. So Mignonette, Chartreuse and grass green and back to this one and then back to this one and there we go cactus is done oh but wait we got grass in here you can do it wrong side well gotta take care of the little grass in here too might as well use the same colors right because you're uh when you repeat colors in different areas on an image it helps with continuity this is e49 dark bark y38 which is honey yr07 cadmium orange r08 vermilion r05 salmon red and yr09 chinese orange again lightest first i'm just gonna do a little bit make them all homogenized. Now we have little fires. Flamingo, I want R34, which is Bougainvillea. Bougainvillea is one of my favorite flowers. Oh yeah, that's more of a flamingo color. Most definitely. Let's add a little R32, which is peach on the wings. R22, light brown for more emphasis on those wings. Just put this brown as part of their beak. Blue violet four for the door and the wheel well. This is blueberry. Two different words. This is BV08, which is blue violet. That's how I'm gonna do it. Blue banners. B23 Phalo Blue with a PH. Now I got E2. I'm gonna go underneath here. I'm gonna do the bottom half a little darker. The E2. Just to do it a little different. To have some variety. And now I gotta get another one darker. EO3. 
I'm gonna put underneath here in the window like that. The curtains are gonna be blue and I like this blue. Oh heck, we're even gonna do this. And then we need flowers. The, the, the flowers, we're gonna just do little pink flowers for me and you, yeah. And here we go. Tires need to be. Oops! My goodness gracious! Sorry about that. Hope I didn't make you sick. Okay, and let's bring in something completely different for the for this. I'm, I'm just doing this because. Modeled ugly wallpaper in the background. Yeah. Perfect. Okay, so uh, what I'm going to do is I am going to cut these, cut these out. And what should appear? I thought I taped you down. I know I taped you down. Why didn't you stick? Cause things just don't wanna work for me today. Yeah. Those all look good. So I'm gonna put that on there. And then I'm gonna turn this and send her through. Oh, goodness gracious. It's beautiful outside. Nice and windy. I love the wind. Ugga mugga. I'm not, I'm not the best at die cutting, I swear. Okay, now let me do the right thing and see I can use this tape again. Put all these guys in here so don't lose them and then start assembling my card. Z Cards. Okay, goes back to its little resting place right there. We have a base. A happy base. Okay, we're going wide again. Ah, figured out what I'm gonna do. What I'm doing is, I got my and fawn small stitched rectangle stackables and four bar rectangles. I don't know which ones are which anymore. I got the one that's the A2 size and I found some cool cactus. Card stop. Can't even think of the word. My brain isn't working today, sorry. Which one side looks like this and one side looks like this. And I'm gonna do one of each. And so what I'm gonna do, this is the back sides. Yes, there are back sides and front sides. And if it happens not to be even, I will be chopping it off. I don't know how how it does that. Don't know. Don't know indeed. I put the cactus. Oh, I put the cactus upside down. Story of my life. Oh my goodness. Yep, put the cactus upside down on this one. Down all the way too hard. I can get it. I can switch it. I can switch it. I can switch it. Oh, yes, I can. Yeah, there we go. Now, since oh, this 
still crooked. Put some more. God, I'm such a mess today. Take your time, Lee. Mm -hmm, like that. Got my little pond cut it. just gonna eye and I'm usually very good at eyeing these okay and there we go one down one to go and there we go that goes there that goes there with that green. More foam tape please. Crazy. I just don't feel like talking right now. Mm -hmm. Okay, oh, so I'm back. Uh, yeah, finish the fronts. Camille helped me. She's here. Say hi, Camille. Hi. Yeah, she helped me. She said I should do the little dipper or the big dipper. I can't figure out which one this is. Uh, a little. In sequins, star sequins in the sky. Yeah, we got a little smoke coming up off the thing. Give them a little basis to stand on. And now I'm gonna stamp the inside sentiment. And I'm gonna use my little Misty for that because I got two of them. Yeah, make it easier on myself. My bone folder, there you go. Now, I'm gonna put it like this. You have fabulous style. How about we just do it in archival black? Just because. And I had Camille pick out the envelopes and we tried different things and we settled on tangerine because all the other colors just weren't working for us. We put a little wig Stella on the flamingos, the happy trails, the cacti. You have fabulous style. I'm gonna put on the envelope, you make me a happy camper. She picked out the washi tape that we're going to put on the outside. It's perfect, right? Mm-hmm. Perfect washi tape because it's got the orange and other colors and it's... I'm going to go outside for a little bit. You want to play with the dogs? Yes. Okay. Have fun. See, isn't this great washi tape? Jeans. That'll be good. Now for the back of the envelopes, I'm going to do my happy mail. the sentiment for the envelope place with the one I didn't use yet <laughs> stays on you make me a happy camper in the bottom corner give you a hint of what's on the inside there you go right there and 
that, my friends, is done. So, we have two cards with our little envelopes, with our little washi tape thingy, my bobs. You have fabulous style right here. I hope you liked it. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Come see me again sometime real soon. And I'm so glad you made the video with me. Yay! Pink flamingos rule. Yay!